yeah, we're really excited here at Mark Pierre White Swansea to um, collaborate with uh, University of Wales Trinity St David on the International Gastronomy course. Um, it, it's great to, uh, to be a part of um, and be pioneers for, uh, for the hospitality industry, um, you know, especially here in Swansea in South Wales with all the great um, suppliers and um, you know, food industry experts we have in the local area. Hi, I'm Lucy and welcome to the Secret Hospitality Group. We're absolutely delighted to partner up with the uni and offer a programme to young individuals coming into hospitality. When we were getting into the industry ourselves, this programme would have been an absolute lifesaver. If we could have had the opportunity to have the education and the experience at the same time, I think we would have been steps ahead of where we are now. The International Gastronomy Management degree has been made with industry for industry and it's really important that our students get the best experience they can during their training years and then moving into future employability and that's what it's all about really to get this valid degree and to give them successful employment opportunities going forward. It's a really exciting time uh, in the UK hospitality industry right now and so we're really proud to be working with the University of Wales Trinity St David. It's a great initiative and the University has developed an excellent reputation in recent years and we're delighted to be part of that. I'm looking forward to welcoming students to help them learn practically to go along with their theory work. And it's great to be a part of this push of local restaurants and pubs and eateries that are really collaborating with the university to really bring you know, new blood into the industry, to really bring excitement in. And of course, in time, new ideas from these students, you know. It's um, a great opportunity to uh, see all these young chefs coming through in this course uh, to grow this industry and this businesses all around the UK, um, bringing my knowledge and experience to them to show them how they can grow. It, it's a collaboration we feel is needed um, with the, the difficulties the industry's had and um, you know many sectors have had over the, uh, over the last two years uh, off the back of Brexit and Covid. Um, you know, we feel it's a real opportunity um, to help drive people into the industry and um, you know, future-proof the industry for Wales. The industry has taken a little bit of a hit since the pandemic, but it's definitely taken a turn and it's an absolute buzzing environment to be in. We are thriving at the minute and we can't wait to introduce people. It's such a great opportunity to come in. We want people who are fresh, young, enthusiastic to join our team. When I started in this industry, it was really London-centric. Uh, everybody, if you wanted a career, you had to go to London. And over the last 20 years, things have changed and moved out. And South Wales is really a pole of attraction. And that's, I mean, we've got plenty uh, uh, to give. We, we, we're looking at every single opportunity to welcome and invite or entice people to, to work for this industry, to embrace this industry. And it, it's great that we are working, we're closely working with, uh, with the university now and uh, to, to promote this industry, to make sure that uh, um, this industry has a future. Yeah, as I said earlier, the sky is the limit. There's lots of things we can achieve together. The food scene in Wales is really gathering momentum. When we opened Beach House six years ago, there wasn't a lot of places about. Um, it was kind of, you know, Wales, we're not known for our, you know, diverse and refined food and stuff like that. But honestly, by now, you know, we have six Michelin star restaurants, we have a two Michelin star restaurants, and even all the other re um, restaurants and eateries and cafes and pubs and all sorts, I think there's some really fantastic, interesting places out there. The course is specifically going to uh, hone in on three 
three main areas being management, back of house and front of house. Um, you know, each, each of those specific areas um, has a lot of different skills and, um, and requirements to be learned. So um, there's, um, there's a great opportunity for this course to, um, to hone in and uh, give people specific qualifications. The consultation process in the writing of this degree has been carried out with industry influencers, restaurateurs, chefs, and it's really important to get their viewpoint into making this degree fit for purpose. We want our students to have the best value, the best experience that they can from studying with us at the University of Wales, Trinity St. David. I think there's a misconception about, you know, people might you know, when they start out that they're just serving food or just cooking a bit of food and doing really basic menial tasks. But actually, it teaches you a massive life skill, how to communicate with people, how to be a part of a team. And later on, when you progress, of course, you, you know, you manage stock control, profit and loss accounts and stuff like that. So it really does kind of teach people how to be a really rounded person. So I really think there's a great industry to be in. Our management team here in the Seren Collection have worked for the best organisations all over the world. Uh, they really have got a global experience profile to draw on and I know students are going to really greatly benefit from that. A student can, couldn't wish for more because you actually learn all sorts of uh, different departments and services and, and, and it enriches you uh, tremendously. For me, one of the most important parts in my role now is passing on my knowledge and developing people to become great restaurateurs, become great chefs, you know, to really kind of hone their skill and to actually unlock this ability they have inside them that they don't even know they have. Each, each department has different levels of, of uh, expertise required. So. Uh, you will learn constantly. Um, and not only this, but uh, as we mentioned earlier on, it's this, people are constantly growing. So moving from, it's very flowing, and people are moving from one department to another or from one position to another. So there's always opportunities for you to actually learn from other people and to see different ways of learning and different ways of teaching. And then this, this is what's incredible because this gives you a magnificent toolbox which will allow you to, you will take that with you wherever you go and you will learn from all these different, different situations that you've been uh, faced with um, because every single day is a different day. Well, in our venues, what's very different is that it's, there's this bit you can't, you can't define and it's just an atmosphere and actually your role in participating in creating that atmosphere. And that's what we get right. Uh, technical skills, the technical skills, and you know, we can, not only are you going to get the technical skills, but you learn how a place sparkles. These are skills that can't really be taught on the book theoretically, and these can only be lived and experienced. And, uh, and again, as I said, this is part of your toolbox, and, and once you've got them, nobody will take them away from you.